Just say what? I knew it. Say what, Nasibo? No, I'm not doing this right now. Exactly, because B U S T E D, you are busted. What? I'm gonna handle you. Handle you. You are tight. Jean Gagne, welcome back to Uncomfortable Growth, hosted by none other than your girl, Google Tsumba, Yansumba, Jujule to assist you to some. For my returning subscribers, I hope that you guys are well at home. And to those that are passing by, okay, I hope you like what you see. And you join the gang and peace. I hope you like what you see. And you join the gang and peace. I hope you are with you. And you join the gang and please. Guys, I know I started this vlog without saying anything, but today is the eve of my birthday. Oh my goodness, there's actually nine minutes until my birthday. I am turning 26. And I have many thoughts about turning 26 um, and the chapter that was 25. Naturally, as your birthday approaches, you start to reflect on the year you've had, the chapter that you've been in and how that age treated you. And um, honestly, 25 wasn't easy for me. Like, I had a lot of fun. For sure, Kawabanga. Woohoo. Um, made a lot of memories. But in the same breath, I feel like it was a year full of a lot of revelations and um having my perspective change in so many different ways you know um regarding so many different things and yeah just drawing nearer to myself and closer to myself and yeah learning myself you know um i feel like 26 feels more intentional uh i, I feel like you know what 25 is cool you know you're in the middle but like 26 now i'm heading to my late 20s i'm not there but i'm heading there you know what i'm saying i'm in the latter half boy and i just feel like i have a vision for myself or a vision for the woman i'd like to be by the age i'm 30 and i can just kind of hear the holy spirit saying to myself that like okay google you want certain things by 30 you know you want to be a certain version of yourself by then that's not going to happen overnight you have four years to implement these things and i guess that's why i feel the need to be more intentional now because i just feel like you know not that i'm running out of time but it's now or never. If I want to become her, if I want to continue to grow, continue to walk in um, God's purpose for my life. And yeah, like I, I just, I got to get a bit serious about certain things. You know, there's certain habits and skills that I've been okay with not having or knowing or learning. But now I'm kind of like, okay, it's not cute. <laughs> like, yeah, you're only hurting yourself. Um, but yeah, I'm proud of myself for getting to 26. I think that every age like off uh, actually oh, my 20s honestly my 20s um in my younger years or well, let me rather say like sub 1920 i honestly didn't see myself um living to certain ages like my depression had really robbed me from seeing a future for myself and wanting a future for myself so each year is genuinely a blessing for me because I never thought that I would be this passionate about living and life and this grateful and this happy and have so much of my life turn around for me. So with each age, I am extremely grateful and happy to be there. But I think it takes a lot to get there. You know, it's not always easy, but it's worth it. And I'm proud of myself. Um, but yeah, I'm going to really drop a podcast on this because I have a lot to say, man. I have a lot to say and... Yeah, 25 wasn't easy. It was a lot of shedding, a lot of learning, um, a lot of my time being spent in isolation. But I feel like 26 is me realizing that I went through all of that for a reason and it's showing and I can feel it. So I just got to continue trusting in myself and my gut and walking with the Lord and having him, you know, just orchestrate my footsteps. But yeah. That's me. Um, I also feel like I haven't vlogged in such a long time. So I'm going to spend the day with you guys, show you guys what I do. Uh, it's also been cool to spend my birthday differently. Like last year, I went to the Cradle Boutique Hotel. And again, this year, I'm in Joburg. And that wasn't my initial plan, honestly. But I mean, I'm here. Mm -hmm. um, 
and I'm gonna have a good day, you know. And I got I'm making myself a dress for my birthday. I have literally no plans. Like Nosi and I are gonna go on a little boat ride in the vault, but I don't have like a oh I'm seeing my friends for dinner, we're doing this. Um but I kind of thought to myself like I'm so fast to make an outfit for a birthday that i'm celebrating with other people like my friends at large you know i'm so quick to put together a cute fit for an event but like it's my birthday and because i'm not really doing anything i don't want to be cute no so i saw this dress that i really like and i was like i'm gonna make it i'm gonna make it crazy because i still haven't seen it i'm trying it on for the first time tomorrow i've been busy and so hasn't got there go but I trust him, okay? I trust him. So I just feel like it's going to work. It's going to fit. It's going to be Zilisi Yoso. Um, so yeah, you guys are going to spend the day with me. You're going to get my dress. I did my nails. I feel like you guys can't really see the color. Uh, but yeah, I did them with Ola. And I just feel like he ate. They're so freaking cute. Love them. Um, forgetting why I did my lashes, but I wanted to try a different style. And... I'm just, I'm not angry at them. Like, I like it. I like it. Okay. The hair is from the Glam Bar. The install is by the Glam Bar. My day starts bright and early tomorrow. I'm doing my makeup at 9.30. Okay. Or oh, I'm getting it done at 9.30. So I was like, I have to just make sure my hair is good. But yeah, I just want to pamper myself. Like, I got to feel cute for myself. Even if I'm not celebrating with everyone. It's about me making sure I have a good day. And again, learning to celebrate my birthday differently has been cool you know some days or some birthdays you want to be about it and have a big thing and other times it's like you don't want to do that you know you just want to make sure that you have a good day for yourself and um having a good day looks different having a good birthday looks different so yeah i feel like i'm gonna have a good day i'm feeling good about 26 i feel like good things are coming like you know when you just feel like you've been doing the work it hasn't been an easy season but i've gotten through it and I feel like I've learned what I needed to learn. I'll continue to learn. But, like, there's been a lot of shedding and internal work. So I just feel like, Lord, whatever you are preparing me for, I am ready. I was so tired of this season. So I'd like to move on, Aigabi. But I'm ready. Okay. That's me, guys. We'll talk throughout the day. Birthday! you made it <laughs> was i not gonna make it <laughs> thank you yeah. i appreciate that thank you dear. hey happy happy birthday hey happy happy birthday go and happy hey happy birthday happy hey hi bo hey Hey! 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 Hi -bo. Hi -bo. Hi -bo. Please come into the light a little bit. Let's, let's actually look. Oh. Oh. Guys, oh my word. Gorge makeup, you guys already. What? Wow. Can you guys see the eyes? How it's. Shoo! Hey, this is such an eyeball. And the hair and then the I nails. Eyeball. Eyeball. <laughs> Okay, let me finish. Hey guys, um, we're about to leave right now. You guys are going to be tired of me, but yeah, just this is me. You can't even see. Finish. Then dip me underway. Okay, I feel like I have to show you guys my beat. Because it's no, no crazy. Is she sick? Oh, is she crazy? It's giving. The word, the song's not coming to me. Cause baby, I can't go anywhere without wishing that you're there. But it'll be me, do be, be, be. Gotta be having deja vu. That's what it's giving. 
Guys, she's been behind the camera the whole day, but look at it. She's giving legs and hips and body, 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 face. Thanks. Never decline. Turn this side. Let's see you smile. Pretty girl in the room, what it do? What it do? Pretty girl in the room, what it do? What it do? I'm your sister, and how about you? Hey you. How are you? Hey you. How are you? How are you? What do what do what do? Oh, you look so pretty. Let's go, tape, let's go, set, let's roll Straighten it, straighten it, straighten it, yeah Straighten it, straighten it, straighten it, yeah Don't not get straightened, but straighten it Don't not get straightened, but straighten it Don't not get straightened, but straighten it You don't get shit straight, you don't straighten it In this gang, sit back, be patient Niggas act like the gang went vacant Niggas act like some been taken Ain't nothing but a little bit of straightening Been kicking shit, popping out daily On the island, it's a movie I'm making I'm counting the narrows, a rubber the narrow. He telling them that you're amazing. Put that shit on, then get shit on. I bought two whips and I put my bitch on. She put this wrist on. She fed the wrist and it went with your milk wrong. Turn a pandemic into a pandemic. You know that's the shit that we on. Them niggas gon' pull up and act like this shit is together. Won't fuck with you home. Uh uh, I don't do the fake kicking. They go a rocket is taking it. It's a problem with you, then we straining it. Swap out the cap with a demon in it. Upgrade the banner with fiends in it. I got some shooters you seen with me. We're running shit back, I just seen ten it. We gonna get straight, straight in, straight in, straight in, yeah, straight, straight in, straight in, yeah. Don't not get straight in, but straight in. Don't not get straight in, but straight in. Don't not get straight in, but straight in. Straight, you don't get shit straight, you don't straight in. The scene had changed. This wonderful guy had rearranged the world around me, and all he did.
I'm not gonna